There we go, look at this bad boy. Mini bike on day 6. I'll take that. Good morning everybody, it is the morning of day 6. Speaking of day 6, uh, tomorrow we are going to be taking on our very first horde. So I think it is about time for us to build some sort of a horde base. And we are going to utilize this uh, Dick's Diner. And I got an idea about a horde base that I want to test out. You guys probably might have watched the latest video that I have dropped uh, about infinite loop base. But one thing about that loop base is that you cannot really use melee weapon. What I want to do is uh, I want to build a version of that base where you can actually use melee weapon. First things first, uh, let us check out our uh, challenges. We got a couple of challenges completed. Play storage container, let's claim all of these and we just leveled up. Let's put uh, one point into agility and let's put one point into master chef. With only one point, I can cook 40% faster. There's a random loot bag right there. Let's get that. Alright, so uh, let's uh, have some breakfast before we head out. After this infested clear job, let us do another job. And then uh, let us uh, start building our base later on. Uh, scrap that, eat the large beef ration and get the rest. Hey, morning. I'm not too sure about the sound of the mini bike. It kind of sounds weak, man, but I guess uh, this is mini bike. Understandable. Jacob's residence. I kind of know this POI. Uh, this is infested clear job, so we gotta be careful. I have crafted a few cobblestone blocks already, so let's start the job and put these blocks here just in case. There's a trash here. Let's get... The hey, there's some stone. We gotta craft some more cobblestone for our horde base, but it's not gonna take that much resource. It's gonna be very simple horde base. I mean, it's uh, our very first horde. Shouldn't be that hard, right? Right, there should be zombie here, right? Hello! Good morning, anyone? No? Okay. All right, let's uh, search this trash. Hey, more stone. I'll take that. Let's search all this uh, trash, man. There you go, more stone. Nice. I don't think we need the uh, uh, rotten flesh, but I'll take that for now. We can always drop that. There's some wood as well. Let's search this trash bin. Don't need the seed. What else we have? Laundry basket. Get all that. There's some shelves here. Hey, there's some uh, duct tape. That's a very luxury resource. I mean, in order to craft the duct tape, you need the cloth fragment, and cloth fragment itself is uh, very scarce. Oh shit! That's some bullshit. Uh, let's open this door. Close the hatch. Oh, is that? <laughs> he died bleeding. All right, Stevio. Good morning, man. Ooh. Is the crap fall of zombies. Let's do some knee shot. Let's run back. Oh, shit. Morning, you guys. Oh, she's feral. That's a heck ton of you. Oh, lady is through. I think she's not dead. Now she is. Let's apply some bleed damage. Alright, one more. Oh, Mo! Morning, man. Late to the party. Man, it is about damn time for us to find some uh, hunting knife, right? I do not want to take on the very first horde with the bone knife. I mean, hunting knife is going to be awesome. There's some wicked book, fortune head books as well. There's some more book. All right, what what we got here? Hello. Okay, let's try to sneak. Oh shit! Hello. Burning zombies here. That's one shot. It. Get back. Oh, shit. 
God damn it, you hurt. Oh! Uh, there's the main stash. Medical supplies, medical books, some vitamin. That's good. Assassin's boot, stealth sprint noise, medium armor rating. What is this? Become hitting faster. Pistol beat. Inflict 10% more damage with 9 mil weapons. This is a very good book. Let's drop the score mil. What am I wearing? Actually, I'm gonna replace my boots with the assassin's boot. It's gonna help us to be a little bit sneaky. And it's medium armor as well. This is some 9 mils. Medical book. Ooh, beaker. That's good. And this is the infested cash. Nice, man. Bunch of stuff. Let's get all that. Alright, job is done. Let's get the hell out of here. Is it me or the mini bike feels a little bit slower? Oh. Morning, Tom Clark. Alright, I'm gonna let you in. Holy crap, what the heck was that, man? Hey, Rekt, I'm back. Morning. You think, hey, jackass, can I lighten that backpack up for you? Yeah, man, I'm gonna take this 109 mils. This is gonna lighten up my backpack. Uh, let's see, fetch job, clear zombies. These two are quite far away. One infested clear job. This fetch job is the nearest, I guess. Film Fanatic's house. Well, good luck. Yep. Take a look, buy some shit let's do that. Let's sell some stuff. Let's get this mail. Handy tool. Read that. Da -da -da. Here we are. Oh, I know this POI, man. A film fanatic. Now let's get our lockpick just in case. Let's craft some uh, cobblestone blocks. Okay, let's start this job. Uh, they are doing some shady film in this POI. I know that for sure. We're gonna be finding some uh, potty goals in here. And Mo, as I remember. Uh, let's get this uh, cement. And actually uh, scrap this for the stone. Let's use one bandage. There's this trash. Some iron. Give me some uh, clay. Or stone. Alright, let's go up. Uh, we're gonna be crawling down into this stupid hole. Which I know there's gonna be one zombo right behind this. God damn it. I don't like tight spaces. There we go. He's down. Remembering this POI like it yesterday. <laughs> There's a book pile here. Let's search that knife guy. Bone knife quality 5. Man, I gotta have some hunting knife, man. Give me some hunting knife. Let's sneak. There's gonna be another zombie if I can sneak here. No. Nope. Okay. There's some trash here, some wood, that's good. Murky water, take that. Pile of books. Uh, we can sell that, let's get the chair for free resources. Let's put down a hatch. I don't really need to put down a hatch, I mean, I'm not like playing super extra difficult level. But just in case, you know. Alright, let's go down. There you go, there's the pot of gold that I was talking about. They've been doing some shady film in this house, I tell ya. Hey, party girl! Oh, she's down. And who's there? Maggie? Ooh, I can shoot through these gaps of stairs. Nice! Alright, let's get our, all our arrows. Hey, there's a magic box. Let's uh, ask a question, man. The pile of books here. Let's loot this first. Armored up book. Some armor parts. Scavenger gloves. What are we wearing? 
Savage Harvest, Medium Armor, Find Better Quality and Loot. Uh, we are wearing Lockpicking Speed, Lockpicking Success. Hey, let's not switch. Magic Box. Am I gonna get a girlfriend this year? <laughs> Come on. Oh. Come on. Holy shit. The Magic Box said yes. <laughs> I guess... Uh, I'm gonna be getting me some girlfriend, gain 5% more EXP kills at night. That's good, man. It's gonna help us during the Horde night. Let's put this mod in on our bow. I mean, I already asked this question about girlfriend before. And the magic box said no. But, you know, we are not gonna give up. <laughs> we can just keep asking. Oh, oh shit, man. That wasn't trash. All right, it's fine. Let's uh, try to sneak some zombies if we can see some. Hey, there's a snake right there. I think we are sneaking a little bit better. It might be because we are wearing a little bit better gear. All right, before we go there, uh, let's harvest this and loot around this area. This book, let's just... Holy shit. Hello? Anyone behind this? Hey, nurse. Looks like the supplies is actually down in the basement. We'll get there. Anyone here? Nightstand. Byron. Hello? No one's here. Comment back. Commando outfit. What does this do, man? <laughs> Natural crit healing. Recovery items work faster. What are we wearing? Sneak effectiveness. Nah, I'm not gonna change my chest armor. My natural crit healing, I don't think it's a nice buff. Maybe we should do some video regarding, you know, uh, ranking the armor set, set bonuses from S tier to, to like a uh, Bad tier. That could be a good idea. But for that, uh, we have to play the game a little bit. And actually, you know, experience the armors that we are finding. Soup, I'll eat that as well. Cooking grill. We can scrap that. Ear of corn, I'll take it. I'm not gonna open the door. Alright, let us proceed down. Mo, I know you're somewhere. Oh shit. No, it's Hanza. Oh my goodness. Oh, I uh, freaking... Oh, this is the dead end. Let's go here. Man, I'm getting some goosebumps, man. Seven days to die never fails to give me some goosebumps. This is why I love this game, man. Okay, what do we have here? Some cabinet. Scrap that and get the iron. Beer, we can sell that. And there's the supplies. There we go. Job is done. Let's uh, finish and get the main stash. Some trash here. Wood. Yep. A toilet. Ooh, a bunch of uh, supplies right there. Drop the seed and get the rest. There's a bunch of wood right here and uh, Honza is waking. Are you alone here? Holy shit, nope. God damn it. What was that? There we go. I think the uh, area is clear now. Let's get all this wood. It's a very good source of wood. This type of uh, logs or firewood. I still have uh, one lockpick. We can try to lockpick this safe. 
Uh, let's loot the rest first. Ammo pile, wood splitter mod, which I don't think I can put that there. How about on the shovel? Yep. Knife guy, read that. Electrical trap book, wickle book, tech junkie. I'll read them all. Alright, let's see if we can crack this open. Holy shit, man. What the heck? We've been so lucky. Alright. I'll take that, man. The job is done. Let's get the hell out of here. Now, before we turn in the job, there's the uh, construction POI. Let's get some uh, cement from here. We can scrap this for the stone. And uh, maybe we'll find some uh, cobblestone here as well. Wait a second, is there a bear here? Now that I remember, there could be. Man, we got a bunch of uh, stone. Over 1000 stone and we've been crafting some cobblestones as well. It's gonna be more than enough. Holy crap, alright. Wake up! There we go, the bear is down. Alright, anything else here? There's some pile of food. Ooh, hobo stew. I'll take that. Read that and get the oil shell. You can sell that. Alright, who's here? Joe! What is this? Find 10% more dukes from ATMs. I'm gonna get this. This infested clear job for tomorrow morning. The Richmond residence. I'll do this. What the heck is going on? Why do I hear a crap ton of footsteps outside? I wrecked. We uh, think we got the uh, light problem outside. Let's do our business real quick. And we should be good. Are you selling anything new? Quickly check your inventory. Tarp? What the heck is this? Oh, I think it's used for the dew collector. I'm gonna buy all these nine mils. Yep. I think we have uh, more than enough ammo. Alright, man. I'll see ya. There's a wandering horde outside. Loot back, I'll get that. Alright. Let's get back home and do some uh, ore base building. Man, we barely have enough cobblestone. I think we need a little bit more cobblestone. But our base is almost complete. Hey, there's a Joe right there. Let me show you what is our base is about, man. Hey, come here, Joe. I want to test this. Joe? Where the hell are you? Oh, come on, man. You need to climb up from there. Ah, this this is an issue. This this might be a little bit too high. Gotta do some more testing, man. But uh, let me show you the uh, base of our base. Look at this. Look at this shape, man. So the idea is that the, we have a pole running right here, and the zombies will come here, 
And then just like the concept of the infinite loop is, they're just gonna get pushed down, just loop around. With this hole we are gonna be able to do some melee damage to the zombies coming up here, but hopefully the zombies will choose this path. That was kind of weird. I mean, this is the type of base that I had in my mind. And hopefully it works, man. Well, anyways, guys, I think I'm going to be ending the episode right here. Tomorrow, let's go ahead and check out our base to see if it's actually working or not. Thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a great day and peace.